Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is the next part of the C++ Hacker Rank series where we just go through some of these Hacker Rank problems. Um, hopefully get the uh, bar rolling on your job search and your technical interview preparation bar rolling. I don't know if that was correct, but um, yeah. I'm going to jump into it. All right, so this problem. Alice and Bob each created one problem for Hacker Inc. The reviewer rates the two challenges, awarding points on a scale from 1 to 100 for three categories. Problem, clarity, originality, and difficulty. The rating for Alice's challenge is a triplet. And you see we have if 0, if 1... We have A of 0, A of 1, A of 2, and the rating for Bob's challenge is the triplet B of 0, B of 1, B of 2. The task is to find their comparison points by comparing A of O with B of O, A of 1 with B of 1, A of 2 with B of 2. Okay? Um, and then we're just comparing if A at I is greater than B at I, then Alice gets the point. If A at I is less than B at I, then Bob gets that point. And then if they're the same value, then no one gets a point. Cool, cool. Um, comparison points is the total points a person has earned. Um, yeah. Cool, cool. All right, yeah. Um, so like here's an example. Right. So this is Alice's points. These are Bob's. Um. Or this is Alice's scores, these are Bob's scores. At index 0, Bob gets the point because 3 is greater than 1. Index 1, no one gets a point because these are the same value. And at index 3, Alice gets the point because 3 is greater than 1. Um, yeah, so I think we can start coding now. Um, yeah. <laughs> cool. And then we can always look at the constraints, saying like, okay, um, no item in the array is going to be greater than 100 or less than 1 in either array. Cool, cool, let's get started. Here it is, complete the compare triplets function below. So one thing we can do, we're going to do this, maybe less shaky shaky. Less shaky shaky it is. There we go. All right, so what we can do here is, let's just create the scores. So like int Alice tally is zero, and um, we can do Bob tally is zero, right? Because uh, I guess that's easier to work with. We have to iterate through, we have to iterate the amount of times, like, you know, if there are three items in the array, we gotta do three iterations. So for int i is zero, as long as i is less than a dot size, um, then i plus plus, we're incrementing. And one thing we're gonna wanna do, we're comparing everything, right? So if a at i is greater than b at, oops, at i, then we are going to increment uh, Alice's tally. Alice's tally plus plus. And um, I mean, we can just do this. If b at i is greater than a at i, then we can increment Bob tally. Cool. And um, we don't have to do any case for if they're the same, because if they're the same, it's just going to keep going. It's not going to, you know, we're, we're not checking for that. If it's the same, nothing gets incremented. So we're just going to leave it as is. And, um, oh, we got to make the vector as well. So I guess we have a um, vector. Um answer this is the answer i guess and um oh, 
Alice Tally and uh, Bob Tally. And let's return and cool. This is a solution. I'm sure there are many others. So I mean, wait, I don't even know that because I didn't even run the code to see if it works. Okay, cool. Now, this is a solution. It's like, okay, you, you always got to run your code. Don't just assume that it's going to work. Because um, I definitely could have clocked myself. I could have had something run, run in here and um, that would have been it for me. Uh, we could even look at some of the test the test case that they show uh, five six seven three six ten one one should have been the output um, but yeah this is a solution this is a solution there are many ways to solve a problem this is just one of them that happens to work um, I'd suggest trying going through these and seeing if there is another way to do it um, but yeah, I'm gonna stop recording. Yeah, that's about it for this one. This is the third video so far, and then I'm gonna film the next one right away. One reason there's a change in scenery was when I was at the table in the living room, my laptop started dying. So here I am back in my room. All right, I'll see you in the next one.